Did you know that getting breast tissue development in teenage boys is really common and is often considered normal? So during puberty, there are various processes that contribute towards the development of breast tissue. And it's seen in around 40% of early teens, but up to 65% of 14 year old boys. And it usually resolves within a couple of years. So the majority will resolve by two years, but 92% of them will completely resolve within three years. The most common form of gynecomastia is where there is a firm lump, which can be a bit tender, and it's usually right behind the nipple and areola. The second most common type is where it resembles typical female breast tissue. And if that's causing significant distress, there's an argument that that can be removed. And the third is usually caused by some sort of endocrine disorder or a genetic disorder, but this type is really rare. Now, if we know that the cause is clearly because of puberty, then no further investigation is really required. Fortunately, this type of breast tissue development is not associated with an increased risk of developing male breast cancer, uh, unless there is an underlying condition called Kleinfelter syndrome, but that is very rare.